What's up guys and welcome to the fourth episode already of the FUT Head Random BSG Hybrid Squad Builder. Now, uh, last time around we had a uh, episode with Inform Garai. If you haven't seen it, please check out the description uh, or my videos on the channel. This time around uh, we're just going to do the same. We are going to go over to FUT Head, uh, which is a FIFA related site, which many of you will uh, of course know. And uh, yeah, we're going to click on the randomized app on this site and uh, we are going to randomize five bronze players five silver players and five um, gold players and out of them five from each card type we are only going to choose one player uh, so that leaves us finally with three players one bronze one silver one gold of course and uh, yeah we're gonna make a hybrid around uh, them three players and we're gonna play a match so uh, let's get on to the randomizer then uh, we're just gonna first uh, pick a bronze player and um, yeah, let's go So the first bronze player is a uh, Polish right back not gonna look at him uh, The second player is gonna be Dogby, which is from the Alveskan doesn't look that bad uh, But like a skill attributes, well, he doesn't look good either uh, Let's put it in that way. This is gonna be our third player This is gonna be our fourth player, which is absolute shite as well and the last player then is going to be this guy, which looks actually uh, half decent. Like many of the uh, bronze players are shit if you randomize them. But this uh, Nito or something uh, plays in the uh, second English league, or the third actually, I think, for pre de Brof United and is from South Africa. So he's pretty nice for hybrids, of course. And uh, he doesn't look that bad as well, like 81 jumping, good pace on him, some good defensive and heading stats, uh, decent dribbling. And um, yeah, we're gonna go for this guy, of course. So onto the silvers then, who are a bit more excited. Uh, this is gonna be our first one playing for the uh, Portugal, no, the, the Polish league and from Ukraine. This is gonna be our second guy, Richards from uh, Swansea. This is gonna be the third guy, but we already do have a right back, Alberto. Um, Liga Adelante goalkeeper, not that bad. Hopefully, something turns on in the last time. Oh, in form Olsen. Uh, I do think I have the coins for it uh, if he is that price, uh, but I just think we should go for his uh, his just non in form because he just also looks decent enough um, and the in form is quite a lot of money so we're gonna go for Olsen and we're gonna choose uh, five gold players or well we're gonna choose one gold player uh, but we're gonna randomize five of them so Ireland being the first one got an in form which we could choose uh, but since we already have Olsen I do want another league so the second player is gonna be Barchiaro looks well, looks half decent. Liga Adelante, maybe we're gonna go for him. Buck Harrell, gonna remember his name. Zeeler is gonna be our third player. The fourth one is gonna be Pabon. Transfer Pabon. Um, so, I, I believe he played for the uh, for Valencia or Sevilla or something in the Liga BBVA, but now he plays for Sao Paulo, Chantone being the fifth one. We're going to go for Pabon, Colombian striker from Sao Paulo, um, and he looks decent enough. Four star skill moves, high low work rates, um, but yeah, three very different players, uh, three uh, very... Uh, weird nation South Africa Sweden and Colombia that's gonna be pretty hard for making a hybrid but uh, yeah I'll be back in just a second once I've finished the team let's okay guys so here we are on the team then uh, we're just gonna put in the players who we randomized uh, we're gonna put them in first so uh, we have chosen for the 4 one 2 one 2 the second variation where we don't have a right or a left midfielder uh, But we do have two um, Center midfielders who can hopefully be something good indeed. So uh, we're, yeah, we're just gonna put in the team together uh, It's actually a quite nice hybrid. Uh, I'm surprised myself. It's not the most creative Creative, sorry, but um, yeah, it does look all right. Got some good players in it. Left back, which we randomized, was Olsen. Didn't uh, go for his inform as he was around 200k, and I thought, yeah, 
he doesn't make that much of a difference only plus one overall rating uh, so we just went for the the normal version needle or something could go see needle just from random letters actually uh, it's gonna be all right back doesn't look bad as I said so uh, 64 rating 78 pace 67 defending and 68 heading as well does look like an all right player and then uh, the left striker is of course gonna be Pabon uh, I believe he played for Valencia uh, I'm not very sure, but it was either Valencia or something like Sevilla or something in the Liga BBVA. But um, those are the three players. We are just going to make a hybrid around um, the other players. And yeah, let's go on to the team then. So in goal, uh, we are going to go with Kune, who is a South African goalkeeper. Not the best uh, stats, but he doesn't be, well, he does look all right. Um, and yeah he's actually the national goalkeeper as well 400 coins only uh not the tallest so that could be a little bit of a problem maybe um but the center backs make up for it so the first one is going to be mariapa who is an awesome center back and the second one is going to be sangwani or either this guy but of course we're going to go for sangwani nine uh, overall rating higher 66 pace 73 defending 76 heading medium high work rate six feet nil so not the tallest as well Mariapa isn't the tallest either um, but Sangwani I remember his uh, uh, what was it his um, man of the match that orange card which he got last year I remember him I think it was from the um, what was it from the World Cup as well but I'm not very sure about that Mariapa then on the other side what a centre back here! 79 pace, 75 defending, 81 heading. Being 5 foot 10, uh, but he does got 81 heading. 5.1k only. He is one. I probably think he's the best uh, silver centre back. But yeah, I do have to play a couple of games, um, of course, to know that. So that's the defence. Rock solid, if you ask me. And uh, let's go on to the midfield. So Dika Koi is gonna be or. Um, CDM yeah, makes sense to use him linking up with the South African players in the squad and uh, with the uh, BPL or the Crystal Palace links uh, but he does look like an all right uh, non-rare silver center defensive midfielder on the left we are gonna go with Bannon and on the right we are gonna go with Charlie two amazing center midfielders both uh, silver gods if you ask me Barry Bannon uh, good card for FIFA for the last couple of years 75 pace 69 shooting 80 passing 76 dribbling uh, 1.9k with the Marshall trade already on him so he's very cheap and he will be very good indeed medium medium work rate and uh, yeah from Crystal Palace as well looks like a real hidden gem um, and with the martial trait on him that does make him better as well so Jolly on the right uh, that I trade on him already when I picked him up for uh, 6.7k which is actually pretty expensive uh, one of the most or well, I think it's the expensive player in the team four star skill most three star uh, weak foot got a transfer to i think it's something like leuven or something in the uh, belgium league so that's a great card if you can pick him up as well on to the attack then which is all three from sao paulo uh, on the center attacking midfielder role we are gonna go with uh, jadson Good player for the last couple of FIFA's uh, five-star skill moves. Very important, of course. Four-star weak foot as well. I remember uh, when he played for Shakhtar. He's a great player in real life. And uh, yeah, so does he for uh, Sao Paulo. 79 pace, 74 shooting, 80 passing. And uh, of course, five-star skill moves is very good indeed. And the right striker then is going to be Wellington, who looks like an absolute tank as well. He was better last year when he played for Spartak. Uh, he's got a Spartak card now as well but I went for his Sao Paulo card of course uh, 1k uh, Forza skill moves Forza weak foot high low work rates 71 heading 73 dribbling 86 base 73 shooting he looks like a very good player indeed so uh, that was actually the hybrid not the most creative got a couple of uh, really strong links in it so uh, yeah again not the most creative but I can see that this will be a very very good team indeed um, now I don't actually know have I 
reviewed Pabon a little bit. If I haven't, then here he is. High-low work rate, 4 star skill moves, 85 pace, 74 shooting, 78 dribbling. Looks like a real gem as well. 350 coins only. And uh, yeah, that was the squad. Let's get on to a game then. And uh, I'll see you in a second. Okay, guys. So we uh, have found ourselves an opponent. Uh, it's just a online... Um, not tournament match or something. His team name is the Pi Pace. He's got, uh, well, he doesn't have full chemistry, but it's a quite nice team indeed. Mnes in the striker role, the Pi and Ins on the wings. Um, and yeah, Rakik is a very good centre back indeed. He's got some Belgian players, some uh, second English league players, and mainly Dutch ones. So um, that's a team we are going to play with, and uh, yeah, hopefully we can win. Okay, go on. Intercept the ball. Good job. Chatson, go on. Use your skills. Baditon. Dika Koi, go on. No one is around you. Shoot. Yes. Okay, so we are already 1-0 up. Six minutes in. Uh, Dika Koi with a goal. Uh, well, rushes forward. Jatson delivered the ball with uh, Wellington, and Wellington gave the ball deep to uh, Dika Koi. Great goal, if you ask me. What a good shot. Uh, for only being a non-rare silver. 1-0 up. Owen, come on. Oh, go on. Pabon. To the 1-2. Chatson. Pabon again. Wait for Wellington in the middle. Cross it. Halitong, come on. Oh, bicycle kick. Shame. Corners. Always overpowered. Go on. Mariapa. No. Sangwani, go on. Shoot another corner maybe we can do something with it this time around Sangwani good shot uh, nice little action here nice little movement with his body Bannon again with the corner go on Sangwani oh yes 2-0 up already 39 minutes in we are 3-0 leading Sangwani corners are overpowered as fuck um, and yeah we managed to score by a corner as well so uh, Sangwani not the tallest but he has this home Okay, so three extra minutes. Don't let him do anything before half time. Oh fuck! Ins. Okay, so what? It was uh, offside, and uh, I think he's just gonna blow the whistle when I uh, pass this free kick around. So also maybe we could actually do something. Bannon, Babon, Bannon again. Go on, cross it. Oh back cross. Babon. Oh <laughs> hello. Pabon with a goal. Well, it's not actually Pabon. It was clearly an own goal. Um, but yeah, the cross was deflected. Not the best cross in the world by uh, Barry Bannon. Um, and yeah, Pabon got on the ball. I went for a cross, but it was deflected. Own goal. 45 minutes in. Uh, we are 3-0 leading just before half time. So uh, if we actually do the same in the second half, uh, this could be a very good match and a very exciting match as well. So what is he going to do? Are you going to go for the kickoff or is he going to rage quit? That could actually be as well because I'm all over him. Yes, he does. So, uh, we've played one half, but yeah, I can show you like five or four actions. So, that will be enough highlights. Uh, let's get back onto the team then. And um, yeah, that will be the end of the video, guys. Okay, guys. So, here we are on the uh, team where we started with, uh, it was a very solid team indeed, Mariapa, great defender, uh, although I only played one match, uh, I know I can't say that much, but um, yeah, I think I will love the team if I play a bit more games with it, Jolly Bannon, great two uh, center midfielders to have in that uh, wide side, and uh, the front three is just very good. Chatson with his four star skills is really, uh, sorry, five star skills even, is really handy. Wellington is a great striker, uh, the same as Pat Bon. Uh, and yeah, that was the team. So, if you like, guys, please leave a like as well. Uh, if you want to see more of these footage, um, please subscribe me. And uh, yeah, share this video around. Have a nice day, and I will catch you guys up next time. Bye, guys. Cheers.